Hello, this is Morning Gallery. The artwork I will introduce today is the work of J. Alden Weir. Julian Alden Weir, 1852-1919, was an American painter and one of the leading figures of the American Impressionist movement. He was born in West Point, New York, and was the son of Robert Walter Weir, a well-known artist and art professor at the United States Military Academy. We received his artistic training in Europe, studying at the École des Beaux-Arts in Paris and working under the guidance of renowned painters like Jean-Léon Jérôme and William Adolphe Bouguereau. He also traveled extensively throughout Europe, studying and painting in Italy, Spain, and Holland. Upon returning to the United States, we're settled in New York City, where he established himself as a prominent painter. He was one of the founding members of the Society of American Artists, and he later became a member of the National Academy of Design. In the late 19th century, we began to spend summers in the town of Coscog, Connecticut, where he established a studio and painted many of his most famous works. He became part of a community of artists who were attracted to the area's natural beauty, and together they formed a Coscob art colony. Weir's paintings are known for their soft, muted colors and impressionistic style. He was particularly interested in capturing the effects of light and atmosphere in his landscapes, and many of his works depict the Connecticut countryside, as well as scenes from his travels in Europe. In addition to painting, Weir was also an accomplished etcher and taught at the Art Students League of New York for many years. He was a mentor to many young artists and played an important role in the development of American Impressionism. Weir's work has been exhibited widely and is represented in the collections of many major museums, including the Metropolitan Museum of Art, the Museum of Fine Arts, Boston, and the National Gallery of Art in Washington, D.C. Today, he is considered one of the most important American painters of the late 19th and early 20th centuries. When appreciating J. Alden Weir's artworks, here are some good points to keep in mind. First, sense of atmosphere. Weir's paintings are known for their soft and muted colors, which help create a sense of atmosphere and mood. Pay attention to the way he captures the effects of light and shadow in his landscapes, and how he uses color to convey a certain emotion or feeling. Second, brushwork. Wiz brushwork is also an important aspect of his paintings. His brushstrokes are often loose and expressive, giving his works a sense of spontaneity and energy. Third, composition. Look at the way Wiz composes his paintings. He often uses natural elements like trees, rocks, and bodies of water to create a sense of depth and perspective. Pay attention to the way he arranges these elements within the frame of the painting to create a harmonious and balanced composition. Fourth, subject matter. Weir's paintings often depict scenes from nature, including landscapes, seascapes, and gardens. Take note of the details he includes in his paintings, such as the flowers, trees, and foliage, and how they interact with the landscape. Finally, Impressionist style. As an Impressionist painter, Weir was interested in capturing the fleeting effects of light and atmosphere. His paintings often feature a sense of movement and change, as if the scene is in flux. Look for the ways in which he captures this sense of transience in his works. By considering these aspects of Weir's artworks, you can gain a deeper appreciation for his unique style and approach to painting. How about starting the day with a cup of coffee and a piece of art? Have a pleasant viewing.